Good morning, everyone. So we are on our way to, let me turn you guys over a little bit. All right. We are on our way to service my vehicle. Um, so let's hope this goes well. I may or may not bring you guys with me in there. I'm hoping it's quick because they're gonna give me a loaner vehicle. Um, so, yeah. I don't really have much planned for today. I wanna say I'm gonna get my nails done, but for the last like week and a half, I've been saying I'm gonna get my nails done and I have not gotten my nails done. So if I do decide, or if I do end up there, then I'll show you guys like what color I choose and things like that because my nails right now, you've probably seen it numerous times at this point, but my nails are, it's about that time. It's broken, it's like grown out, all kind of things. So yeah. Um, I shall see you all soon. So this is what I ended up getting. Um, know guys maybe I'm just I don't know maybe my my standards are just too high like too high so they gave me this and let me just show you guys I don't know if you can even see how dirty this vehicle is <laughs> I'm gonna lower my standards I I'm I'm really just gonna lower my standards. And there's that. And it's okay with that. I think if I lower my standards, I won't be disappointed. And that's that. Good morning, I'm gonna help you. Good morning, how are you? Good, good. I'm good. Can I have a large hot coffee with three creams? Yes, please. Anything else? No, that's it. Thank you. Thank you. No, that's it. Good. just got back well I didn't just get back from doing my nails um I have like some stuff here on my bed I have the a different like moody kind of setup in here so I wanted to show you guys my nails because I finally like I said to you guys before I brought my vehicle for servicing they gave me a loaner again I showed you guys the footage of how dirty the vehicle was but I really do feel like I just need to lower my expectations lower my standards a little bit because 
I didn't want to talk too much because I was on a phone call and I was a little bit busy in between then so you saw like little snippets of what was going on but now that I have a little bit of time so I drive an SUV I don't know if I've ever mentioned that um, I drive an SUV for a reason uh, I've had oh my god I've driven SUVs I think I've only had two one, two, three like cars in my life and they were just so small for me no my husband is tall so we need we need that leg space um so I drive an SUV and they give me for the loaner vehicle mind you I didn't ask to bring my vehicle in um you didn't they didn't ask me what I needed I figured in my head that you know what vehicle I drive, you know what vehicle you're going to be servicing, why would you give me a C300? Like, I don't know if you guys know about Mercedes or any vehicle, like a C300 is a car. Like, it's a car, I drive an SUV. My my SUV is not a small SUV. Um, and you gave me a C300? I was just like and I I come on here and I share with you guys like what I do in a day I share like things that happen with me um, but I don't come off that way I can come off that way like I I can be very vocal and I'll let you know my thoughts but when I first present my thoughts to you I'm very respectful um, because that's what I would want in return and I say this every time at the end of my videos be be kind to yourself and be kind to others um, because I truly believe in being kind but I also believe in respect um, so yeah like respect me respect my time respect the things that I do and just common decency right like look my vehicle up and don't like nonchalantly say Oh, here, here is a, a C300. Have me sign all this paperwork. Here's a C300 as your loaner. So I was like, shocked. <laughs> I'm not even gonna lie. At first, I just like stared at her. She's probably like, like, are you okay? Like, that's how she looked at me, but I was staring at her and I'm like, is this the vehicle that you guys are giving me as a loaner? And that's exactly how I presented it like my voice changes I I come I become very like sophisticated when I first approach you because inside I'm like like what but I don't want to present that initially so I'm like is is this the loaner that you're gonna give me and she's like yes and I'm like it's not gonna work I'm sorry like I gave you guys an SUV the loaner car isn't gonna work and she's like well that's all we have and I'm like <laughs> and it's the the way you present things right she's like well that's all we have and I'm like okay well that's not what I'm taking so either you find me a different vehicle or I will leave right now and you guys will have to find a way to compensate me for my time because this would be the second time that you guys have had me come here with no end result um, so she went and she spoke to someone and they were able to get me an SUV, a much, a much smaller SUV, but nonetheless, I was able to get the leg room. So I was like, okay, that's fine. Um, I just cannot wait to get out of this vehicle. Um, I want my vehicle back. I just, I want to be done with, I think I really want to be done with Mercedes as a whole. I've had so many awful experiences and I shared this in my other vlog like servicing matters the customer service is so important and it's been awful like it's just and it's non-stop and I don't know if it's me I don't think it's me because I've experienced different customer service like I've experienced I've had multiple vehicles and the service have not they have nothing like this like nothing like this even with the loaner vehicle which isn't anything crazy but I've had a loaner before she was like make sure you bring it back to where the gas was when we gave it to you like literally was almost like I was at Enterprise I when I go to Enterprise to rent a vehicle 
it's because I want to rent the vehicle. I want, like, these are things that I want to do when I go to rent a vehicle. I'm not getting a loaner by choice. You guys are telling me that because you guys are don't have enough staff or whatever the case may be, you need to keep my vehicle for longer, so you need to give me a loaner vehicle. So with that inconvenience, you need to make it much more of a convenience for me. But that is not how they operate for some reason. Again, I don't know if this is Mercedes as a whole, but the ones I've been to, the different dealerships I've been to, trash throw them all in the trash because that's exactly how they've been and that's just it anyways apart from that um because i've kind of digressed in my emotions around this entire thing um i wanted to share with you guys the color that i chose let's see if it'll do you guys see oh, i'm like in love with the color i'm a little bit ashy but i love pink like do you guys see how brown and pink looks together i just love pink pink looks very nice but sometimes i'll try to like deviate from pink because i will i will sit here and get pink all the time like different shades of pink but i like to play around with the colors a little bit too i just love color um but yeah so this stuff is an unboxing i just did so if you want to check that out that should be out I don't know when I'll drop it. I have other content that I need to put out first, so I don't know when I'm going to put out this unboxing. But that's what this is all about. I love this setup. I don't know. This might almost become my permanent, like, filming setup because I like this. It's comfortable. I'm on the bed. Um, it's just, like, it's a little bit bouncy. I love the gray in the back with the candle. What do you guys think? Let me know. Let me know down below. Do you guys kind of see this setup? I don't know. I like it. I like it. And I'm happy. I'm just happy right now. Despite... Okay. Quick dis disclaimer. I'm going to digress again. Um, even though I talk about like my vehicle situation and how annoying it is and how inconvenienced like how much it inconveniences me, is that a word? I don't know, I don't care. Um, how much it is an inconvenience to me, I don't let it ruin my day. Like I'll digress, but then I'll get right back, back into like my happy mood because there are bigger things in life than this nonsense that they're doing to me. Like it's annoying, I would hate, I, I would prefer not to go through it, but it's not gonna ruin my day. I will continue to have fun enjoy my day and just do things throughout the day um so that's why i'm so happy because i've already got my nails done and it's been so long and i hope i do not crack it crack them like i did the last time um but yeah i don't know what else i want to do today um i know i have a couple packages coming in maybe i'll unbox them with you oh yesterday i got these boots let me see i'll show you it up getting these boots yesterday like look at them i love that you see that the black and the white they're like knee high boots ignore all the noise in the back but do you guys see that oh my god oh, these with like maybe like a dress i don't know believe it or not you see black and white and they're neutral but this is actually such a statement piece that you have to be very careful how you style it. Like, yes, you can do like an all black outfit with these, but the white would probably throw it off a little. So you would probably want to pair it with like some white, like a white handbag, or you can do all white with like a black bag. But believe it or not, it's not like, I don't want to make anyone afraid to style them, but they can be a very, they can be very tricky to style. Um, but I love it. I can actually see this with like maybe a blue. I have this blue dress that I love to wear. Like if I could wear it every day, I would because it's so thick. I love the puff sleeve ness of it. Um, it's very, I really, really like it, but I can see myself pairing this with it in like a black purse. But yeah, I wanted to share this with you guys because um, I ended up getting that yesterday. And yeah, 
that's pretty much it I'm probably just gonna clean up a little bit because I have boxes everywhere you see me looking around and it's because I'm like <sighs> do I really have to clean this I do but do I really want to no but do I have to yes so I have to clean up I have to rip all these boxes up because I recycle so I'll rip all these boxes up and throw all the other stuff away and that's pretty much it that's all I'm gonna do for today I need to like get my hair done so one thing about me you'll notice that on my channel like I need to work on doing my hair I despise doing my hair so when I have a hairstyle I'll wear that hairstyle over and over and over again like I'll wrap it and I'll wear it over and over and over again because it's just easier for me like dealing with hair hair anything is just it's a like for me it's a lot like it's a lot I have a lot of hair you guys see this pull back and you may not realize but in here it's just so thick like my hair is so thick um so when I have a hairstyle I, I keep it for a while but I need to switch it up I don't know what I want to do in my area which is so good I have there are a few people that can do hair so I don't know if I want to do like just regular box braid knotless I kind of want to do locks again I had locks before um I kind of want to do that again but I don't know the length like I love the short locks but then I'm like damn can I put that up if I need to put it up or I don't know I'm just thinking about all these different hairstyles that I want to do but I definitely need to do because I need to do my hair like this ponytail it's I'm over it <laughs> I'm over it I'm overseeing my hair like this all of the time but yeah that's it that's all you're gonna see of me today if I if I just stay home if I go somewhere I'll show you guys that but if not that's all this is it this is it for today um, but I'll see you all tomorrow all right so we're driving good morning by the way I didn't say good morning um, I'm just stopping to pick up a coffee because I need a coffee ASAP it's definitely coffee time it's 12 15 and I have not had a coffee so we're gonna go get a coffee and then let's see what else I'm gonna do but I may show you guys around this little it's the place I went to before but I didn't get to show you guys enough footage so I'm gonna try to get some more footage for you guys when we get in there Going this way. Oh yeah. Okay. Oh, you said you've been in here before. I have. I remember the place. Like I don't remember where it is. I remember inside. I don't remember how it's outside. I'm definitely gonna get
just left brunch. Um, it was good. It was good. You know, it's brunch. So we had the cinnamon buns and the pineapple coconut scone. That was really good. My coffee, which I will drink this thing throughout the day. And what is this? A blood orange lemonade. It's a little tart, but it's good. Um, and now I just have to run a couple errands and then I want to go to the stores I'm really trying to avoid the stores this Christmas I'm doing most of whatever shopping I need to do I'm gonna do online I'm not going in stores um, I just I don't have the patience for the stores this year um, I didn't even do like Black Friday. Usually, I when even for Black Friday, I usually shop, shop, and I didn't even do that because I do not have the patience for stores this year. People just are not nice, and I'm trying to remain kind and nice, so I'm not going to any stores. But yeah, I'm just gonna run a couple errands, and then I'll see you guys soon.